what's up guys welcome back to my channel my name is Angela Altieri if this is your first time here and welcome to the video today we have a sneaker unboxing so we have another easy sneaker unboxing this intro sorry um this intro doesn't need to be long so if you're interested in the details and the unboxing of the easy quantum barium then you know the deal you know the drill do you know the vibes? Let's get it. I filmed this and didn't have my mic on, but before we get into the video, we have a giveaway. I'm eating pretzels, sorry. <laughs> we have a giveaway in this video. I've recently be owie. <laughs> Ooh, that might bruise. I've recently been talking about this product for a while because I've had this for a year. This is the limited edition Travis Scott X Reese's Puffs cereal that launched on his website and his website alone, TravisScott.com. <laughs> um, this costs me fifty dollars plus fifteen. Fifty dollars plus fifteen dollars shipping, which is sixty-five dollars um yeah it's a year old i know i posted it for sale somewhere and then they took it down and i never put it back up anywhere so it's just been sitting i have it in the same bubble wrap i got it in the same box i got it in it's just been sitting protected appreciating depreciating i don't know i'm, I'm ready to let this go and give it away to someone i don't need to sell it you know I had my time with it we've had our fun and it's time to go to one of you <laughs> so if you're interested in this limited edition Travis Scott cereal I'll leave a link down below to my giveaway it'll have all the instructions um, how much time you have to enter It'll probably be around two weeks. Yeah, it'll probably be open for about two weeks. Um, I'll announce the winner on Twitter, IG, and perhaps in one of my videos, or we'll announce it in a video of mine. Um, there will be multiple ways to get uh, multiple entries, so be sure to enter as much as possible if you're really interested in winning. You can sell it yourself, um, give it away, put it on display, hold on to it, whatever your heart desires. It really is a cool piece to have, but we've had our run and it's time to let it go. You know what I mean? that's it if you're interested in winning this product or you know people who will be interested the link is down below as i said so without further ado let's get it let's get it all right so here we are this is the easy quantum barium this released on june 25th on adidas us and easy supply they were also raffled on a couple of sites. These retailed for $250 before shipping and taxes. Here we have these standard cardboard. Oh, oh my god, I hit my throat. These standard cardboard easy box, but it does have quantum on it now. I'm assuming this is just how Adidas spells quantum. That's going to be how they um, label the shoe instead of spelling out quantum fully. We have the size tag. This is a size. <laughs> Here we have the size tag. This is a size five. And yeah, the official colorway. The official colorway is barium, and it does say basketball on on the size tag. Although my light back. Although Adidas claims this is a lifestyle shoe, not a basketball shoe. Quite interesting. Okie doke. So here is here are the here are the shoes. Do 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 look how tiny size five is. Um all right, some details on the shoe. We have a 
very dark charcoal gray suede toe panel for durability going up we have a thin neoprene tongue it's very very thin very thin oh my goodness it's very very thin then you have black rope lacing and the loops are actually hidden on the insides of the upper and this tongue is also connected to the rest of the upper of the shoe then on the sides of the shoe right here is a kind of tan gray knitting with 3m within it on top of that a plastic kind of charcoal look kind of marbleized um plastic ripped caging very interesting colors there's also a black soft lining there you have a plastic heel counter and a gray you can tell almost on camera there's like sprinkles of 3m like an overspray of 3m probably a result of this silver um 3m heel counter on this and right here oh do you see that oh, it's not lined up so it's worse on the side Not a fan of that. Not a fan. On the bottom we have the lighting is intense. A cream semi translucent sole. And of course, I don't know if I could I don't think if my nails would permit, but the insole is black with the Yeezys and Yeezys with the Yeezy and Adidas logo. That's what the shoe looks like. Um I'm not keeping these. I actually tried on a size five and a half. Oh, sizing. Um, sometimes I'm in between a five, five and a half. Um, and since three fifties are very knitted, I do get a little leeway, and I could go with a five. But these have a lot more structure to them, so I tried on a five and a half, and I would say, I guess they're true to size. Um, they fit well i will say i am a ankle sock wearer and this lining especially back here on the ankle felt scratchy to me i i knew that if i wore these all day long by a few hours my ankle would be tore up <laughs> um if i didn't have anything protecting it and it was rubbing against this same with my aliens i have the same issue i have to wear thicker socks that go above the shoe because this was scratching me i do feel like my ankle is very secure in here um but it is because it's it's not a basketball shoe necessarily but i would understand why my ankle is so secured if it was a basketball shoe my brother is a well, I don't, he's not a basketball player, but he plays a lot of basketball, and he did and he did play a lot in high school. And I showed him the shoe, of course. Told me they're a little too happy for basketball. That he would prefer not to wear something like this to play because they were too heavy, and he would prefer something lighter than this. But yeah, and I will say it's a quite chunky shoe, of course, with Adidas. And easy we're used to the chunk but I feel like this whole this piece right here is just adding extra length <laughs> I'm sure it's adding extra durability as well but it's just adding extra inches on it's just adding extra inches onto the foot like I put these on and I felt like I looked half size even bigger than what I normally am all right guys so oh Com was it comfortable when i put them on they weren't necessarily revolutionary comfortable in terms of boost i would say 350s are a lot more comfortable 380s are a lot more comfortable so there's that probably more comfortable than um a 700 but still um so yeah there's my Oh my god, do not let it hit my makeup. So that's my unboxing, review, roundup, 
of the Z quantum barium. And if you didn't know, barium is an element on the periodic table. And that's that. BA. Um, so yeah, that's my review. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to hit the like button down below. Comment what you think of these shoes. Did you cop? Did you not? Did you not care? Do you not care still? And if you did cop, let me know where you cop from. These were from SNS actually. Sneakers and stuff. Right? I think so. I think so. Um, I might have to double check that. <laughs> but yeah. Let me know down below what you think of these shoes and what other Yeezy releases you're looking forward to or looking out for the rest of the summer or the year. What colorways you want to see in the Quantums. Yeah, that's that's it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell notification if you're feeling froggy. I post every Thursday and Sunday. If you like me and you like this video share it to a friend one friend all your friends instagram twitter and link all my social media down below thank you so 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 much for watching and i hope to catch you in the next one